Hey, what's up? Hope you're having a great weekend. I'm just showing you some pictures from our weekend. This is a picture of Simon and I when we go for our walks. He loves it because he gets to stop at the park. I get my walk in and then he's all tired out for his nap. So it works out really great. And he just loves being outside and going on um, the different playgrounds at the different parks that we go to. So our garden has been incredible this year. We started everything from seed except for a couple of bell pepper plants, which you'll see, but it's just, Amazing how much things grow after they really get established. We have so much squash. This is a buttercup squash. We have butternut squash, spaghetti squash, some yellow squash. Here's some bell peppers. We have green peppers and red peppers, and um, they've just done really well this year. I snagged those pepper plants for 50 cents on clearance. And then our tomato plants have just gone wild. I didn't prune them for about a week when we were on vacation, and we came home, and they were just giant tomato bushes, which isn't what I wanted. I wanted them to grow nice and tall, but hey, they're tomatoes and they're delicious and we have hundreds <laughs> and they're so good. And Simon just loves playing in the garden. His favorite thing to do is to turn on the water every night um, for our drip irrigation system that we installed and um, that's his favorite part to help. So I don't know if you've ever seen that meme of the toddler trying to sleep in between their parents and they both just get kicked. Anyway, that happened this weekend and I had to take a picture because it totally made me laugh. So I made some salsa with the tomatoes and peppers out of our garden, and it has been so delicious. I've literally put it on everything that I possibly can, and um, it's my favorite thing right now. So I'm 22 weeks pregnant, and we're having a girl. We think we're going to name her Cecily. The doctor says that I've only gained five pounds, but since the day I took a pregnancy test and weighed myself that day, I'm up seven pounds, but either way, I'm really really happy with um, that part of the pregnancy so far. So I collect vintage toys, um, specifically Fisher Price toys when I can find them. And I found this adorable houseboat for 50 cents at the thrift store. And I just love it. And I looked up the original on eBay and I want the whole set now, but I'm not gonna pay $129 for it. I just think it's so cute. Oh my heck, I'm just obsessed with the original. So for breakfast today, I had eggs and some cheese and salsa. So seven points total for my breakfast. And then I had half of a peach. And then I saved the other half for later that I had with the string cheese for one point. And this is my absolute favorite herbal tea. It's a licorice spice. It's so good. For lunch, I had a taco salad. It was 12 points. I had some ground sirloin for three points, cheese for three points, sour cream and a little homemade ranch for three points, olives and some chips. So I also did a little bit of low carb sugar-free baking this weekend just to try some new recipes out. Um, everything turned out really good, but as always, even when it's low carb, it adds up really quick. This was a four point brownie sundae that I had and then I made Dan um, a four point ice cream sandwich out of the peanut butter cookies and he said it was really good. And then I also had two of the cookies for another um, four points. So anyway, it was delicious. So for dinner, I made an almond meal pizza gluten-free obviously half of it was with pepperoni the other half was with some barbecue chicken and then we covered the whole thing in vegetables and um, it obviously made a huge mess doing all that baking the pizza the desserts my dishwasher was running non-stop today Finally, it's all loaded in the dishwasher. Um, another tip is we bought a really nice toaster oven and we're able to cook everything. I don't even think I've used my oven more than like two or three times this whole summer. It's been awesome. So this is our pizza. The final product was seven points per slice. I had two slices at dinner and it was just a tiny bit dry. So I had some ranch for another point. So you'll see today my total was a little higher than I had planned. It was 45 out of 38 points. Um, my lunch was 12 and then and when I was baking, just having the sundae and then two of the cookies to sample, it adds up so fast. That was eight points. So just because something is low carb doesn't always mean that it's going to be low point. Same thing with the pizza. Yes, it was low carb, but it wasn't necessarily low point. But, um, you know, I feel good about trying to focus on low carb right now, so I'll take a few extra points um, here and there. So anyway, this was my day. I hope that you had a great weekend. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.